Lathrop Police Department. You got these guys gathering information on me that they're not supposed to be gathering. What's crime do you guys suspect me of? Suspect me of being involved in any criminal activity at all? No. Okay, so why take a picture? Well, suspicious is you're in a public place, so yeah. you're, you're you're on duty, bud. Pol yeah. So what criminal activity do you suspect I'm involved in? Well, you're taking pictures of uh, the people behind the desk. Is that you, criminal? You could be casing. No, 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 no. Yeah. What's going on, Bay Fam? It's your boy, Bay Area Transparency, and we're back at it once again. And for this video, we're in the city of Lathrop, California. We went ahead and went out there to the city hall to do an employee conduct check, and this is what happened. You guys saw a little snippet. This isn't a crazy video where everything goes haywire like my usual videos, but it's a video that proves a very, very strong point. Police do not know the laws. They do not care if they're violating your rights. They do not care about your privacy they don't care about any of that they get away with it every day because their superiors back them up but on the other note I have some crazy videos coming as you guys can see this video was recorded on the 6th of December I've been out getting videos I've been everywhere I got some wild stuff coming down the pipeline to you guys so stay tuned I'm gonna try to pump out as many videos for the rest of this month as I possibly can be sure to follow us on our Facebook Bay Area Transparency official definitely follow us on Instagram at Bay Area Transparency I'm not going to keep you waiting anymore. Let's get to the video. Oh yeah, real quick. I had court today for our federal uh, ticket, our federal charge that we got for the Social Security office. We are set for trial in February. I have also contacted the ACLU that will hopefully be helping me with this case. Stay tuned, baby. I'll let you guys know. I'll do a live, update you, all that good stuff. BAT, let's get to it. All right, cool. And hop on up here. Where's this at? It's No, I'm good. Appreciate you. Okay. Can I ask what you're doing? Yeah, just taking some pictures. Okay, are you with the city? No. Oh, okay. No, by myself. Okay, you're with the, like, you live in Lee Group, or you're taking pictures of no, I don't the live decorations? Here. Yeah, just the whole office. Oh, okay. Yep. Okay. Cool. Um, and your name, sir? I don't give that. I don't give that information. Okay. Well, what was your name? Um, I was just wondering because I just want to make sure it, uh, it just kind of odd uh, as you're taking pictures. I was just asking what it was. Is there something I can help you with? No, no, no. I'm asking what was your name? My name's Rupal. Oh, okay. So just what, do you, what do you do here? I'm the customer service supervisor here. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. So is there anything I can help you with? No. Any questions? Any? No. No. Okay. I'm good. Appreciate you. All right. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. and whatnot so at this point i'm just gonna kind of come out here for a bit see what happens and then bump on oh here come the lathrop police i see them they're here all right since they called the pd i'm gonna go ahead and hop back in fuck them Checking the see if there's any violations. Let's get the cars. These are the sides. All right, let's get their cars. I heard them try to call somebody's name, but it's not mine, so wrong guy. 
must be thinking of somebody else who does this. And leave no fingerprints. Let them find out who I am. Lathrop Police Department. You got these guys gathering information on me that they're not supposed to be gathering. Why they would be doing that, I don't know. Let's, let's, let's go ask them. All right, let's find out why they're gathering information on a member of the public. Why were you guys gathering information on me? Excuse me? Why were you just gathering information on me on your phone? Took a picture of you? Yeah, why? That's gathering information on a member of the public that's not committing a crime, so why'd you do that? Taking a photo. Personal phone? Company phone? No, PD phone. Okay. You know, what's crime do you guys suspect me of? Suspect me of being involved in any criminal activity at all? No. Okay, so why take a picture? You're in a public place, so you're you're, you're, you're on there. duty, bud. Police, are, you you know the federal laws. Police are not allowed to gather information on members of the public unless you suspect that they're involved in criminal activity. Okay. So, what criminal activity do you suspect I'm involved in? You're taking pictures of the people behind the desk. Is that you criminal? Could, you could be cases. No, 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 no. You have to suspect a crime. Not you could be. You could be. The sky could fucking fall in two hours. What Excuse crime me. do you suspect me of committing? You just said you don't suspect me of any criminal activity at all, yet you're gathering information on a member of the public. You know the title code that you're referencing? Go look it up, bud. You ain't supposed to do it. I'll tell you that much. Well, I think you may be a little misinformed, but it's okay. I'm Okay, Bay fam, let's go ahead and stop that right there. As I've done a million times, police always try to say, well, what policy is that? What title is it? What code is it? What case law is it? And they think that I don't know because I don't tell them. No, I just don't tell you because I expect you to know it. I feel like you should already know it, and the fact that you don't know it is actually kind of disgraceful. So, this is from the Lathrop Police Department's own policy manual. And let me remind you, this policy is there because because of the laws because the laws that protect our privacy they have a huge section on first amendment activities assemblies recording in public all these things but let's read from section 431.3.1 photographs and video recordings and let's read the second paragraph of this section Photographs and videos will not be used or retained for the sole purpose of collecting or maintaining information about the political, religious, or social views of associations or the activities of any individual, group, association, organization, corporation, business, or partnership unless, unless such information directly relates to an investigation of criminal activities and there is reasonable suspicion that the subject of the information is involved in criminal conduct so mr officer do you now understand that you cannot gather information on the citizens it's right there in your policy and it's in your policy because of the laws and i believe the federal law is like 28 CFR 23.2 or something like that. I forget what it is. That's part of it. And there's much, much more to it. That's not the only law that backs this up. Let's get back to the video. I'll tell you that much. Well, I think you may be a little misinformed, but it's okay. I'm misinformed. <laughs> you guys can just gather any information you want on anybody. Uh, there, no, you can't. There's lots of laws that protect us from that. What's your name and badge number? I'm going ask more... Uh, my badge number 24, but we usually go by our way, uh, which is 1269. No, what's yours? Uh, Lowen, badge number 17, ID number 1295. So you got these guys who think it's okay to just gather all the information they want on anybody of the in the public, saying, well, you're in public, so... Uh, yeah, body cams are on. That's different. That's much different. That's way different. You guys wear that for safety and because the public makes you because all the foul shit that cops do. You don't get to just take pictures for your report, put them in when I'm you gonna, want. I'm going to take this photo. I'm going to upload it to whatever. Uh, what? This thing Axel. goes up to evidence.com. Evidence Axon. 
doesn't matter. Same, same program. Doesn't matter. You guys don't get you to gather. Same, same no, 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 no. You were using that to gather better photos to make sure you got photos of me to gather information on me. Yeah, this is going to be the best video of you. The, so then why take the pictures on your phones? For what? But you got the you got the better picture you got the better pictures right there by your camera. No, this is a video. Yeah, I know, but it's also a picture, right? Do you know what video is? <laughs> video is just pictures at certain frames per second. That's all it is. You can't screenshot of it. Come on, come on. You fucking kidding? Are you kidding? <laughs> you guys need to stop trying to gather information on people that are just random members of the public. You guys can't do that shit. You don't get to just gather information on people. Constantly being information gathered. Doesn't not for these purposes. When a, a, a an officer is on duty, and you're conducting your duties as a police officer, if there's no crime, you don't gather the information. You guys don't gather. I know you guys like to try and get names and things like this, but if somebody didn't give it to you, you don't take pictures, so you can make sure you have pictures of people doing nothing illegal. So a call for service was generated. Doesn't matter. Oh, it does. Doesn't I matter. That's why you're being you're a little misinformed. So a call for service was generated. For what? crime we were out here for what crime like i said it wasn't necessarily a crime that was exactly reported, but there was someone walking around with the hoodie and glasses and filming it and so you stuff. guys walk up and you say hey there's no crime committed like i heard you told tell him no crime committed he's good and you guys bounce you guys don't do the shit that you guys typically do and go take pictures of people and follow people for hours and do all this stupid shit so you can try to get license plate numbers i see you guys do that to that fucking guy bay area transparency all the fucking time what do you mean you guys? I don't work in the Bay Area. I work in Lathrop. Well, I just see, I watch this video and I see it happen all the time. And, not, and so... It's not all police officers together, right? Should we lump no, it, 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 it kind of is. Should we lump it, all first amendment officers it, it together? It kind of is fair to lump you guys together. Because you're doing exactly what the rest of them always do on the videos. I'm good, man. So, yeah, yeah. so, so that's what I don't understand is, is why do you guys feel that you can just gather information on members of the public that aren't committing any crime? So there's no title code against it, so we're allowed to do that. I, I know that's what you're trying to reference, but there's none that actually forbids it. Like I said, we had a call for service here, and that's why we're out here. So you think that you, you think that there's no laws that protect the public from police just gathering our information? Sir, so there's like seven cameras recording us right now. That's so. different. That's much different. You don't. I don't think you understand the difference between you guys having me maybe on your body cams because you walked through for a call and you guys purposely taking pictures on your cell phones it's a big difference you are now per that you have to wear and you wear it for transparency you taking other pictures and probably zooming in and doing everything you guys did is not okay because you're gathering information when you guys don't suspect any crime there's a big difference. So I think you're misinformed and you don't understand the way that it works. You guys aren't supposed to do that. You're not doing your job the right way. You need to do your job the right way. And then people probably wouldn't be coming and recording you guys. Okay. You are absolutely entitled to your own opinion, sir. <laughs> do you have a uh, YouTube channel? This is the typical ignorance that is seen, man. They, they think that they do nothing wrong and they can just pretty much do whatever they want. Well, I'm, you're in public and I'm, you know, I'm just taking a picture. No, no, it doesn't work that way. You're on duty. You're on duty on public funds. And right now you guys are pretty much wasting them. Just standing around, sitting around over here. So it's really not the way it works. But they can think that it is. Ignorant, ignorant, ignorant. Yeah, let's go see what this guy's doing. These guys, it's crazy how ignorant these guys are. Just, they act like they can just kind of do whatever they want. You know what I mean? Oh, he shut his door for us. That's good. You gonna let me by? Yeah. Cool. Well, this is the other one who was just taking the pictures. So yeah, it's the it's the ignorance that's seen all the time. All good. Personal phone call. Nah, it's 
so this guy's trying to tell me I can't record because he's on the phone for an investigation. It's out of your mind. You need privacy, you create privacy. Sitting in, sitting in your car is not creating in any way, shape, or form creating privacy. So what law is that that I can't record because he's on the phone? Would there be a law tied to that one? Or are you just spinning random nonsense again? Looks like this guy's going out for another call. Yeah, that's one of the things that irritates me the most is these dudes coming, taking pictures and acting like they just have a right to do that. Or, well, it's, I'm just taking a picture. You're on camera all over. Yeah, but you're on fucking duty and you don't have the authority to do that. There's laws that protect the public from having information gathered on them by police unless they're suspected of suspected of being involved in criminal activity. And so this dude's doing what they would typically do. And he's saying, well, it, it, we got a call for service and you could be. You could be doing this. You could be doing that. No, if you have something that reasonably would lead a reasonable person to suspect that that crime was happening or being committed, then you would have the authority and the authorization to take pictures like that. But you don't get to just gather information on whoever you want because they're out in public. You're on duty. You have to live up to certain standards, laws, etc. And he's not. And that's the that's the the bottom line. So, you got a law on that one? This guy is just chilling. You don't got a law on it? No law? So, um, so we got things going off in the city right now. So, probably have to cut your video for. I would just. I you guys should have really been gone. You guys should have went in and told them there was nothing going on wrong and bounce. Why you're still here? I have no clue, but. You made a uh, you made a, a, a accusation there that it was illegal for me to record your your partner because he was on the phone. I'm asking you what law that is. If he's record, if he's on the phone with a call for service and you're recording him, what violation? Law what law? Is. Can you tell me what law it is? I'll give you the law once you tell me the title code that says that uh, we can't take a photo. It's, there's not a title code. There's federal law that protects that. It, it, there's no law that says I can't record your partner on the phone. So, I mean, that's the bottom line. You guys want privacy? You create it. You can record you all you want. All right, you too. Do better. Look. Straight ignorance, man. Talking about they're going to cut my video short and, and all this shit. Or, you know, he's going to cut it short because he's leaving. That, that's the one thing that I wasn't even going to talk to those police officers at all. I wasn't going to say anything to them. But then I look over and they're fucking taking pictures of me because I'm taking pictures of their vehicle. And that right there is what pisses me off. Like you're not supposed to be gathering information on us. Um, and that's exactly what they're doing. And because he doesn't know it, he's like, cite the law. You should already know these laws. There's federal laws. There's several states have enacted this in, in, into law. Oregon's one of those states. There's a bunch of states that say police cannot sit there and gather information on you if you're not doing anything illegal. You're not suspected of being involved in criminal activity. They can't sit there and gather information. And for them to, in a roundabout way to say, well, we have body cams and you're on camera right here in these buildings. So it's the same thing. It's not because you're now going out of your way to specifically gather information on me. If you just had me on your body cam, it would be what it would be. You're not going out of your way to do it. But by taking a picture with your cell phone and zooming in and making sure you get the good little picture that you want, that's going out of your way to gather the information. Now, do I care if I'm randomly on camera? No, but I do care if police are gathering information. This is what we're here to point out. So, now, was it a crazy video? Did they do a bunch of stupid shit? No, pretty much besides gathering information on me. 